Hello, hello, folks, and welcome back to Mordheim, City of the Damned. Let's just make sure it's recording. Recording locally, recording locally, recording locally, recording locally, recording locally, recording locally. Everything's taking up just fantastic. Do, 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 do. Yep, all as well. Let us continue. It was actually just uh yeah. It was actually just earlier today that I um recorded the last set. For those uh, curious, like um went got some sleep, went saw Doctor Strange, and uh, came back. Actually, technically, ac well, not technically, actu actually, it was yesterday when I recorded the last set. It's ticked over to the day after now. But still, close enough. I was thinking of doing bookworms now, but since I've spent so much money on it, I think I'll do this instead. It's tempting to try one of these, but um, like I wouldn't want to do this. I'm I want this, but it's brutal one, so I'm thinking I'll just go with normal. Especially since like this guy was still getting struck down on a normal mission, though that was kind of due to my own uh, over eagerness rather than anything else. I still want to be careful. Fog settles over the ruins. Unable to pick up the enemy's trail, your warriors deploy from their wagon and spread out to sweep the air in search of your foe. Don't know why there's always that weird audio fuckery going on there when it's loading. It's quite annoying. Ah, so this is what they mean by a wide arc. This is actually really fucking annoying. It's not a great level for being out in a you know a huge arc. In, in other levels, just like line, just line of it. Here, it's so dramatically spaced out. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <sighs> I think we can fill all but one slots. I d actually don't know how many people we uh, I have. I've either no, I have ten people. A leader, four heroes, and what six other guys? I am not. I don't know. But if it's six other guys, I think that'll mean I have eleven. Which I don't think I have. So yeah, I think I have to fill all of these slots before I can actually do the mission. I could count. Uh, three. Four, five. Oh, I can't actually. Unlike uh, later on, you can't actually scroll through to see where people are coming in. Also, I'm going up against vampires. Of course I am. As much as I may not want to, I think I'm going to pull back. Uh, like pull these back to here. This guy can go down there. They can uh, move to here. And then we'll all, like, regroup here. So. There's this guy here. This guy here. In case anything happens, I'll give an archer over to this side. Okay, good, they can actually jump down there for a moment. I was concerned that he couldn't. Okay. With her here. And her here. And... Sure, you can go there. And... You go there, and you there. In all honesty, it doesn't really matter. 
I'm rather annoyed by their high initiative, in all honesty. Despite a lot of them having really high initiative, some of them have actually quite low initiative. It's like lower than Ulrich and the champion. Hmm. Rather all over the board. I wonder, have I seen any of them yet? I would hope not. I would imagine not. But considering how f far and dramatic this spread out has been, you never know. It must get really awkward to get around the city with these, like, wandering, just, you know, ghosts and, you know, sp spirits of the damned floating around, you know? It must be very awkward. He didn't yeah. At least he didn't accidentally hurt himself jumping down. I'll take the shard. I need to also gather up as much weird stone as I can while I'm doing this. Uh, doing this mission. And I'm also tempted in making it uh, run. Uh, making a run? Yeah, that works. Making a run for their cart. It just would be awkward considering. I will, I will never clue where they are. I'm not. I look, almost kind of want to just um, engage. Uh, with my group and leave just one person run to go get it but they've quite likely left a guard so on and so forth just hmm. I'm not sure if I can move my whole group up to get it and once you start getting engaged you get bogged down quite quickly and it'll be quite easy to get engaged in a large group Redstone. Oh, this building certainly isn't up to code. Uh, let's try and get up the stairs. Ooh, I can do it too. Come on. Also, for those curious, I actually quite liked Doctor Strange. It was quite good. I know it's going to be like 2017 by the time this comes out, you know. Be late for my commentary on a movie that came out the year before, but eh. Not a big deal. I'm really fond of having to climb up here, but I want, like I said, I want to get as much weird stone as possible. Is there a way to scooch up? Nah, it couldn't be. At least it was a shard. I'll be more miffed if it was just a fragment. A shard at least worth five fragments, you know? I'll prefer the cluster. And I think I actually remember seeing a cluster in one of these bags before now that I think about it. But I'm not certain. Okay. I kind of hope they do some looting themselves of Weird Zone. Then have those uh, the looters as like the forefront of their force, because that way I can bludgeon their face in and take their their loot. All right, they've taken a bit. Hopefully, they've run it right over to me. My open and welcoming sword swords. Actually, beyond hmm. I'm not entirely sure if anyone even used swords. I think the smugglers do. As, you know, a side weapon. Uh, power, yeah. Hmm. Have I seen anyone else? Uh... No marker. Nah, I haven't. I am tempted in making a trip over here. Because there's like four bits in the one building. 
but they're probably going to be near there. Just tempting to swing by here. Probably could do so. Especially if once they've all grouped up, we're going to start moving south. It's just in case we get attacked or whatever. Don't like stringing people along, you know? Like bit by bit. Just seems like a asking to get attacked kind of thing. Okay. Let me actually meander over here a little. Don't still don't see anyone. Good. Just being awfully cautious right now because knowing my look, if I was to run into any group, it would be um, like their entire group, and I'm like only four of my people here, less than half. Uh, hmm. Hmm. I'm just trying to f f actually find a way around to them. Hmm. You know what? Oh, I'm around to these guys. All right then, here will work fine. Quite amazing if they actually hit something in Overwatch, but sure, I'll leave them in it. Like, seriously, I do like those, you know, skullfish things. It looks like a cool little statue, I have to say. Here uh, we go into Paris Sands. Let me think. The only way down to here, from here, well, is either go all the way around or jump down here. So I think we should start actually clustering over this side. Means less movement points spent. Ooh, excuse me. Probably should have moved that uh, henchman down a bit further, but it's not too much of a big deal. As long as they can get out of the way once they hop down. Let's actually take a quick stroll down this way. There's things randomly bubbling. Totally reassuring. Just completely, completely reassuring. Okay. I'm just going to pull back now. Um, yeah, ambush. It doesn't really matter what I do. I'm too far away from the enemies at present to be bothered by them. In all honesty, I don't really expect to see them for a turn or two. It's a large map. We're a fair bit away. We're all rather spread out. The enemy might be thinking the same thing as myself and, you know, trying to actually gather some people up. A new round has started. Also, did you notice the bats flying around over here? I think they're... That's a little map detail solely for the uh, vampires. So I've never noticed that before. Or maybe I just haven't been observant. Bode are possible. Ugh. Wonder who's the ones with high initiative. Heroes? Strangely high initiative zombies? What? And personally, I just keep hoping they, they're charging right for me. These, who, whichever ones are looting. They just make a beeline. That, dashing straight there. Straight for me. And honestly, I'm thinking the next mission should be the story mission. Don't want to level it too much, you know? 
considering I have so many low level people with me, it's probably a good idea to have really high level people for the mission with me as well. Uh, but I don't want to be too burly. Actually, I just noticed in the map for a moment, you there's a, you can actually see that they're in uh, Overwatch and whatnot when uh, before these symbols popped in. Like, watch, see that that guy, those two are in Overwatch or ambush. Oh, there's a weird mass of flesh over there. It's really, really creepy. Yeah, we wait here. Actually, wait. I'm starting to wonder, do we actually need to jump down? Um, not jump down here, I mean, jump down when we're, um... Uh, here. Ah, those aren't jump down point, uh, those aren't ramps or whatever, those were roofs. Quite annoyingly. And, uh, and yeah, if we jump down here, we're on the same level as them now. So, alright. Okay, we'll just leave them here. Uh, that guy there in Overwatch. We'll bring this guy up here with uh, this guy. Such great names. This guy, that guy, Jim. Great, wonderful, creative names. Okay. Now, two, uh, now their turn again. And they've grabbed some more weird stone. They have four so far. I've gotten two shards. Hopefully, I get to do battle with, uh, uh, you know, whichever mi minions it dares that it's been looting. Because, well, that would be kind of nice. I can just prize the loot, uh, uh, the weird stone after a corpse. I hate to crush their will and secure it in your chest part. It was just steal the idol? Sure. It kind of... Actually, no, it doesn't. I was going to say, it makes sense. Like, you know, if it's in their chest, they can't get it back. But if it's just been delivered, then they have a chance. But they still have a chance of losing the chest. You know? So, not really. Okay, passed. Smooth over there, but that's uh, not weird stone. We'll just have that in ambush stance. Hmm. Can loot that. I could, I suppose, go in and try to loot the house there. Might also be worth trying to loot there, though. I always have to keep in mind there's a fair chance they've already set a looting. Another shard. And honestly, whenever I see bodies like that, or at least just there, I all I can think of is what was it? Dark Souls? You know, you see the corpses with the weird glowy stuff on it, and you could lose a soul or whatever. Then, yeah. Mm. Took four damage. Not a big deal. Just a bit of a nuisance. Also, that looks weird. See how they have the chaos corruption thing there. Alright. 
looks like it's planted into the ground, but it's there isn't the ground for it to be planted into. Then there's other like debris just floating on top of nothing. Looks kind of wrong. I kind of, I mean, I 